I'm new to TMA, so not, oh, okay, answers it right there. So not sure if this has been asked yet, but I have way more access to woods riding than track, but wanting to start going to the track. So does focusing on technique in the woods potentially make you more effective on the track, or is it neither here nor there? Thanks in advance. Chad, you could argue me on this, but I would just say that anything you do on two wheels is going to translate to different facets of, of your riding. So practicing your technique and trying to hone your technique in in the woods is only going to help you when you get to the track. In my opinion, I think there's less variables on a moto track, and so therefore it is easier than it is riding in the woods. So practice in the woods and and have confidence when you go to the track. Usually woods guys come into the track are super nervous. They're worried about the jumps, which the jumps are the easiest part. And uh, ask me for advice on how to build confidence and how to start learning the jumps because I have a very simple, safe process to learn how to do it. And then as far as the riding goes, yeah, absolutely. Everything you do in the woods will translate over the exact attack position from the feet to the knees, to the hips and butt, to the chest, to the elbows, to the vision, to all of that, it translates extremely well. So yeah, practice, watch the videos in here, study it, everything that I teach on the track, pretend I'm teaching it in the woods. And by the way, we also have a pretty darn specific off-road masterclass coming out with Rich Larson, who is a very high level instructor. That's going to be for, you know, your double blip type obstacles, you're going up over big, big obstacles that you have to do a kind of a larger double blip on, log doubles, stuff like that, hill climbs and getting stuck on hill climbs. So things that maybe aren't relatable to a moto situation, we're gonna cover all of that and we have covered all that in the Rich Larson Master Course. That comes out at some point this, uh, this month in June. So keep your eyes peeled for that as well. So many plugs in this podcast, but we have so many exciting things coming out. Good question, Chad. Thank you for sending it in. If you guys enjoyed this podcast clip and you want to listen to full episodes, you can do so on Spotify and Apple Music. If you want to send in your own video submission, you can join us in the Moto Academy family inside of the Moto Academy app by just going to themotoacademy.com. That's also where you can sign up for a class. Okay, guys. See you next episode.